if you're building an app in Adobe DPS and you want to see what the well the app name that appears on the screen is going to look like if you see here's an example of one that I've done if you want to see what it looks like you can test it before you commit to it before you upload the folio and create the app and all that kind of thing so here's a, a quick uh, tip for doing that if you're in InDesign and you've got your folio builder panel and you want to go in and you want to you know create the app you come out here and select the folio itself you're going to see create app if we click create app it's going to open up the dps app builder okay here we are you'll see then we can click on continue that's going to take us right in and, and ab, have us actually build the app i'm always faced with the app name and i'm like okay well that's what shows up out there well we can put something like 13 characters in there Okay, but if you notice over here, this is kind of cool. This little tip right there. Test your app, you can do this. I'm going to go out to my uh, device. You can see that I've got an app I created right here, but I want to test the name. So if you go to a browser on the app, let's say I'm on my iPad and I go to a browser and, hey, I got my site open here. What we can do is we can come up here, tap on that, and say add to home screen. See right there? Click on add to home screen. Tap on add to home screen, rather. And then you can type the name of the app, keeping it under 13 characters, because if it's not under 13 characters, and I'm actually trying to click on it right there, are you kidding me? That's my device. Uh, if it's not under 13 characters, you're gonna get the dot, 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 and it's gonna you know, make it smaller. So I'll just say uh, my app name. I'll try that. And then I'll click add. And then if you look, you'll see right there just to test it out, just to see what it's gonna look like. And it's simple, this is dumb, okay? But I saw that and I was like, that's awesome. I've actually had to deal with that before. So there you go.